After exclusively using a Snapdragon chip for the Galaxy S23, Samsung is rumored to bring back Exynos chips to at least some Galaxy S24 phones next year. The company could use the Exynos 2400 processor in Galaxy S24 series phones released in Africa, Europe and parts of Asia, while the Snapdragon Edge N3 could be used in phones sold in China, South Korea and the US. The specifications of the Exynos 2400 processor have now been leaked. According to a report from China, the Exynos 2400 is built using an improved version of Samsung Foundry's 4 nanometers fabrication process. Apparently, the chipset uses a 10-core CPU featuring one Cortex-X4 CPU core clocked at 3.1 GHz, two Cortex-A720 CPU cores clocked at 2.9 GHz, three Cortex-A720 CPU cores clocked at 2.6 GHz, and four Cortex-A520 CPU cores clocked at 1.8 GHz. In comparison, the Snapdragon Agent 3 is set to feature an octa-core CPU with one Cortex-X4 CPU core, five Cortex-A720 CPU cores and just two Cortex-A520 CPU cores. Similar to the Snapdragon Edge Gen 3, the Exynos 2400 is set to be compatible only with 64-bit apps, which means it can't run older 32-bit apps. The chip is rumored to be compatible with UFS 4.0 storage and LPDDR5X RAM with a bandwidth of 8.5 gigabits per second. The built in ISP image signal processor that processes images from the camera sensor can reportedly handle up to 320 megapixels camera sensors and up to 8K 60fps video. In the graphics department, the Exynos 2400 is rumored to feature the Xclipse 940 GPU, which uses 2x the GPU cores compared to the Xclipse 920 GPU in the Exynos 2200. That should theoretically mean twice the graphics performance compared to the Exynos 2200, which should bring in the Exynos. 2400s to the level of the Snapdragon Edge Gen 2, but we still don't know the clock speeds of these RDNA 2 cores, so the performance could be a lot higher. The Exynos 2400 is also said to offer enhanced AI computing performance compared to its predecessor. Regarding connectivity, the upcoming Exynos chip is said to come equipped with the Exynos 5300 modem unveiled earlier this year. It has up to 10 gigabits per second maximum downlink speeds on a 5G network. It supports NSA and SA5. 5G networks and is compatible with MMWave and sub 6 GHz networks. That's powered with the 5G modem in the Snapdragon Agent 2. The modem is also said to be compatible with two way satellite connectivity for emergency calling and messaging when there is no cellular network in the area.